How's it going everyone? Um, today I wanted to bring back um, an old favourite. Um, this is uh, Valis Neria Americana, uh, Twisted Valis. Um, it can also be known as Tate Grass. Um, it can be called um, Ill Grass. And it's, I've also heard it being called Water Celery. Um, not that I'd ever want to eat it, of course. Um, it's, a, it's a beautiful plant. Um, and it's it's one of the oldest plants used, I believe. Um, I know it's the it's the first plant I ever started out when I got into planted tanks. Um, it spreads very fast. Um, by the way of runners, you'll get you'll get a, a runner coming off, and then another plant will shoot up, and then it'll keep going. Um, this area here, this white area, is called the crown. Um, you don't want to bury too much of that into the substrate. Just try and bury this uh, this little end bit. You see this there? Uh, try and try and bury that into the substrate and leave this clear. Um, you'll find that um, it's easier for you to remove um, dead um, or damaged stems. Um, what you want to do, rather than if if you see a damaged end or if it's going brown or something, don't rip it across like that take it back to the base and just pull it off because what will happen is that bit that stayed on there that'll just that'll just rot away um, and then you'll just have like this um, mushy brown um, stem floating around just rotting in your tank um, it's, it's quite widely used um, for backings of tanks people are t will tend to put some at the back of their tank just to fill in uh, the glass um, and it can also be put to one side so it trails over um, temperature wise 20 to 28 degrees um, it's no problem uh, pH it hasn't got a problem with with any type of pH level so um, it, I don't know 6 to 6 to 8 pH something like that um, lighting you can have low, medium or high lighting, it's, it's not a problem at all, um, it likes all types of lighting. Um, it does get quite long, um, it can get to two to three foot long, um, this type. Um, you can also get the Gigantia, uh, which can get to over a, a metre long. Um, I believe it's, uh, it was first, first discovered in Asia, um, but I, I can't be 100% on that. Um, it can also suffer from sudden melting. Um, I've had this before in the past where things would be going great, it would, it would look lovely, then all of a sudden it would just start melting and I'll have no idea why. Um, but touch wood, um, I've not had anything like that for a long time, but I thought it was worth mentioning. Um, if you find that it stops sending out runners, um, just peel back a few of the, uh, the longer older leaves and you should find that it will start uh, sending runners out again um, let's see if I can show you the uh, twist on it you can see the twist on the leaves um, but highly recommend it let's, let's bring it back everyone use it put one piece in your tank at least and you'll soon see it spread um, we can't let a, an old favorite die away so thank you very much for watching everyone, um, I hope that's given you a little bit of information and it's been great to talk about um, an old favourite of mine. Take care.